Meghan Markle's fairy tale wedding to Prince Harry was nearly three months ago, but royal fans are still analyzing every piece of footage from the big day, including when a figure appeared to hand the bride her bouquet as she began her walk down the aisle. Some believed it was a special moment between Meghan and her sister-in-law Kate Middleton, who they thought was the mysterious figure to present the flower arrangement. Of course, the mother of three had already taken her seat at the front of the church with her husband, Prince William, and other members of the royal family when the handoff occurred. It was likely Samantha Cohen, Queen Elizabeth's former assistant private secretary, who was behind the quick exchange. Cohen was wearing a light pink dress and ensemble, which some confused for Kate's go-to off-white bespoke Alexander McQueen coat dress. Cohen, 49, is set to become Prince Harry's private secretary when the current head of the couple's household leaves this summer. She was also tasked with helping Meghan behind the scenes, helping the new Duchess with protocol and navigating how to address people and manage her new position in the royal world, an insider previously. She will make sure Meghan is as happy as she can be without ruffling feathers, a source said of the Australian-born courtier, who is well liked by both William and Harry. She will represent her voice both internally and externally and fight her battles. Meghan's bouquet carried an extremely special meaning. Just days before heading to Windsor ahead of their wedding, Prince Harry picked several flowers from the couple's private garden at their home at Kensington Palace. He gave them to florist Philippa Craddock to be added to her bespoke bridal bouquet. Her beautiful bouquet also had a tribute to Princess Diana, Harry's late mother, the inclusion of forget-me-nots, Diana's favorite flowers. According to the palace, the use of the forget-me-nots was intentional to honor Diana's memory on the couple's wedding day. The wedding bouquet was done in the gentle, ethereal, relaxed style, according to a statement from the palace. A variety of flowers were included, scented sweet peas, lily of the valley, a still bee, jasmine and astrantia, and sprigs of myrtle all bound with a naturally dyed, raw silk ribbon, oak ribbon, 